this is really an opportunity for companies um, in Israel to get funding mm -hmm. and make the bridge over to New York and to the United States. And to the degree that I can help with that, I'm very excited to. Now I'm here with Bill Saniford. Bill, thank you for joining me here on Mind Your Business. Absolutely, it's, it's nice to be here. Well, I understand you're involved with you were involved with Property Shark. Tell me, tell me a little about your background. Okay, well, so yes, I was the former CEO of Property Shark, wow. and, and actually, I, I was brought in to Property Shark as the vice president of sales in 2005. I was the fifth hire. Within a year and ten months, I became the CEO. Wow! And uh, tripled revenues, quadrupled traffic, scaled out the company nationwide, and sold it to Yardi Systems. Nice. And, ah, nice story. Yeah, so and since then, I have been working almost exclusively in the prop tech space. I've been the CEO of another company called Urban, which is uh, another second generation data aggregator that did some sophisticated machine learning and artificial intelligence. And I've been working as a mentor for Metaprop, which is New York City's largest uh, uh, prop tech BC. Nice. Now, you know, we're here today for Built Up Ventures. You know, what do you find interesting about Built Up Ventures? Yeah, it's a great question. I mean, we do have uh, a lot of people that are coming into the space in prop tech, and prop tech is uh, an exploding area. Obviously, all the technologies around the buildings, real estate in general is one of the largest asset classes around, so all of this technology is very important, and that's great. And what, what really um, Built Up is doing, and it's unique and different, is that they are focused on bringing new companies from Israel into New York, and that's great. So um, the teams there should be great, and I'm very excited about learning about their companies and what they can offer to our ecosystem. So you even touched on something, because I was going to ask you, I mean, do we really need another prop tech, you know, VC? You know? Well, the, the answer, the quick answer is absolutely, because we don't have one from Israel. Right, and so this is really an opportunity for companies um, in Israel to get funding mm -hmm. and make the bridge over to New York and to the United States. And to the degree that I can help with that, I'm very excited to. Special. Any final takeaways that you could, uh, your vision for this, where do you see this going? So I think we're really just at the beginning of, of the prop tech revolution, if you want to call it that, it is it is really in its nascency. I mean, I was around working in prop tech before prop tech was prop tech, right. and um, now I, I think we're starting to catch on. But we've got a long way to go. And again, this is a ma the major asset class for the entire world, and there is so much that we can do in the areas of, of data and construction with modular. Um, you have artificial intelligence that's right. going to be right. huge in the future, and and facilitate our livelihoods. Bill, thank you for joining me here on Mind Your Business. Absolutely, it's like, nice to be here. I love the honor of interviewing C-level executives and sharing their great advice and perspective on Mind Your Business. I'd love to get your feedback. Post it in the comments below and subscribe. You'll never miss an edition of Mind Your Business.